Today, we are celebrating Computer Science Education Week all across the 720 square miles that encompasses LA Unified. So my students were trying to figure out a way to help design for those further away from power. We were making a prototype so that we can help other students with autism express themselves. So some of them had designed a sweater where he pressed the finger if you moved it. It said, hi, my name is. Another one said, I'm hungry. For me, it's like a whole new world. So I feel grateful to have access to those things because I can really do a lot more to help others. They're integrating language arts, they're integrating art, they're integrating music, and so to put all of that together into something for good. I feel that coding is a way to help everybody, no matter who they are. So when you do an event like today, there's a couple of things that are happening. One, you're inviting the whole school to the table. If you have new students at the school that have maybe never engaged in computer science ever before, they have an opportunity to experience that today. The folks that came today are community stakeholders at our school. I wanted them to know this is what you've been investing in, this is what you've been partnering with us in. Those principals that come in and see, we've only been doing this for three or four months, this can be at your school too in just a short period of time. It's an important skill because you don't only learn how to code, but you also learn about life skills, so teamwork, patience, double checking. So even though you might not think about using coding as your future career, those skills that you have, you can take them with you anywhere and any job that you decide to do because you're always working with people around you. It's got a lot of design principles in it and logical thinking and that's what really computer science is and it's now critical across all fields and all careers, ways we communicate, everything. For so long, computer science was not really fully present in schools with high numbers of kids of color and low-income students. So in LA Unified, the demographics of our students is 73% Latino. However, the private industry in terms of computer science does not reflect that whatsoever. So if we were able to really provide that opportunity for access, we would also be having an impact on the industry. And so this computer science movement is really an equity movement. That's what the work is about, providing the opportunities for students who wouldn't have it otherwise, and really opening up the field for everyone. What we're seeing here is only one of the many initiatives that the Instructional Technology Initiative is undertaking. If you're not exposed to these kinds of opportunities, whether it's computer science or anything having to do with instructional technology, you don't know where you can go. That's a blocked off path for you. If we can change the computer science educational pathways of youth today, that they'll be able to take that knowledge into whatever career pathways they choose to pursue in the future to solve community issues and problems that need the diverse perspectives of many people to solve them. 